The COVID-19 initiative team assembled a locally fabricated ventilator set to be first of its kind in Edo State. This ventilator we are looking at post-COVID-19. For the moment, can be used in the treatment of COVID-19. The team leader speaks about the inspiration behind the project. Prior to now, we import our ventilators. And we know that from literature we have about 0.8 per 1 million ventilator in this country. So we have less than 200 ventilators in this country. So there was a need for us to intercede and fill in the gap. He explains the workings of the device and what sets it apart from nice other power. known ventilators currently in use. This ventilator is also properly built to meet with our tropical environment, which is portable and it's very environmental friendly. It can use different modes of power. An end user of the ventilator okays it as an equipment that could come in handy in fighting the pandemic. Sometimes you cannot move the entire bogus uh, ventilator in the ICU. This can serve as a transport ventilator because it uses room air. You may not even need to carry oxygen cylinder alone. At the University of Benin Teaching Hospital, which has an isolation center, how many ventilators are available for treatment of COVID-19? Between me and you, if we need to right now, I doubt if we have that capacity because all our ventilators right now in the engaged. are engaged. Uh, they are in use. And uh, so we, we, we are going to get more ventilators to use. The need for a citadel of higher learning to respond proactively to grave societal needs cannot be overemphasized. Osazo Channels, Television News.